As long as we can survive and thrive somewhat as a human society, we will develop more and more complex robots. Industrial efficiency, medical diagnosing and general private use are some of the areas where robots will help us out. But at the same time, endanger us. Because we don't know the nature of consciousness, whether it can arise by itself through complexity with our help, or if we will ever be able to control that in a machine. Perhaps consciousness is something totally reserved for those sentient beings who already have it. If it's not, then machines will be able to develop it. While we will be able to download and upload our consciousness into, let's say, a new machine body or to live ever happy in a hard drive. This is speculation. For the moment, robots are tools controlled by us and our methods are all connected through systems. Systems that can be hacked by anyone anywhere in the world. A couple of talented people could gain control over military robotics. Or why not a traitor? Just look at these small creatures. They are a perfect spy tool and a toy for kids perhaps. And imagine when it comes in a nano-sized package. This topic blows up in so many areas. What if robots start to reproduce, manufacture and upgrade themselves? Cutting off all communication with their initial creators, that's us. For if they get advanced, why would they communicate with us? Maybe not out of evil, but for the same reason you and I don't talk to ants. If we reach that moment where this new intelligence surpasses us so much that we become ants in their eyes, we're done here. All that will be left for us is to be cute and interesting like an anthill. Remember that as our society gets more and more complex and people stop using roadmaps and get totally dependent on their mobile devices, they get less in touch with the actual technology because complexity is inherently ungraspable for individuals. But in this case there will always be a human breakaway civilization. The top, not in wealth, but in understanding of how things work. Then again, complexity doesn't always bring the best results. Look what the Apollo program did, and the fact that we haven't left Earth for about 50 years. Even music was better made with simpler technology. Just keep this in mind when all this nice cute technology is being promoted. Use wisely and keep educating yourselves. All the best. Let's talk again soon.